Thanks so much for tuning into my channel. We're getting at it bright and early and knocking things off the to-do list as soon as we can today. And honestly, it's because I just want to go play Stardew Valley. <laughs> but, you know, I, I have to be responsible first. So I'm making myself be responsible and then I get to play Stardew. So we're doing my work. We're going to work on my reading, my extended reading. I've got to work on my six week course. I've got to work on my upcoming event. Um, you know, for the most part, the work is done, but I'm going to keep adding little finishing touches until the end because, you know, as a creative, that's what we do. <laughs> so if y'all are still interested in the Empress Embodiment event, we do still have, um, Oh, probably three or four seats open, I'd say. Um, so if you're interested in that, please email me. Please email me. I thought they'd fill up, but I said something about how they were filling up quick. And so now I think nobody wants to <laughs> email me or something. But still, if you want to, please email me. Please join the event. We would love to see you there. Um, we're going to be talking about Empress Embodiment. We're going to be talking about Divine Feminine. We're going to be talking about all that. So... Um, we're going to get into the reading now. I pulled this strength card. A lot of us are going to have to call upon our strength here. Um, you know, I myself am, am needing to take this to heart right now because I just started off my morning on the wrong note and, <laughs> um, you know, I just, I'm hoping that it improves. So I'm really calling on my strength and, you know, trying to get my chores done so that I can do the fun things that I want to do. And some of y'all are going to have to do the same judgments. We've got karma coming in. Yeah. It's like, <laughs> I definitely talked some shit that I shouldn't have in my last video. And now I'm receiving my karma for it. <laughs> Sorry again, Joy. You're probably not going to watch my videos ever again, and I don't blame you, but <laughs> it is what it is. It is what it is, you know? Some of y'all, you know, maybe some of y'all are kind of dealing with some karma too, and you're having to call upon your strength. Because a lot of times I pull this and I'm like, this is definitely about your person, because why would we be going through karma? Y'all... Our shit stinks too, you know, like <laughs> we are, we are not perfect. We mess up too. We have to experience karma as well. And we have to kind of know that, hey, we're dealing with this because we made our bed and now we got to lie in it. So, you know, take this how it resonates. It could be your person. It obviously could be your person that needs to call upon their strength because they're dealing with their karma. But it's also like, you know, maybe you're not watching for a person and you're just watching for yourself. I definitely do a lot of videos for Divine Feminine and, you know, most of my videos are kind of, you know, about Divine Masculine almost, but this one's definitely, you know, Page of Blades. Sometimes we are our own worst enemy and we're the ones that, you know, <laughs> only problems we ever have is, is the ones that we cause for ourselves. You know, that definitely isn't always the case. I definitely, you know, growing up when you're a child, it's not your, it's not your fault that adults are failing you and, um, you know, you you get hurt sometimes, but, you know, as you grow up and you kind of, you know, repeat the cycles that you observed in your family and, and your parents and and the adults in your life, you know, at that point, you are the one that is causing the pain in your life. You're the one that is causing the distress and you really need to own up to that with this page of blades for sure. Like. Yeah, six of coins, so <clears throat> balance is being restored here. Balance is being restored, you know? Sometimes we have to go through the lows so that we can experience the highs. And that's just how it is, you know? We can't just be happy and we can't be positive all the time. That's not the complete human experience, you know? Positive negativity is a very real thing, especially in the spiritual community. And that's something that I do not abide by. That 
fake positive crap, that toxic positivity is not, mm -mm, we're not doing that here. <laughs> like, I will send you love and light, you know, but I will also call you on your bullshit. And that's what tarot is all about. We don't do toxic positivity. Three of rods. So I'm definitely sensing... It's like a blocking communication. It's almost like... It's almost like you're not quite willing to <laughs> accept the role that you played here. And um, You know. In your life to receive this karma. But, you know, you're going to realize that it's all happening for a reason. These lessons are being learned for a reason, you know. It's going to be okay. You're going to be able to forgive yourself. You're going to be able to move past this. Everything, you know, this too shall pass is what I'm trying to say. Is this seven? Yeah, seven of elixirs. So, we definitely need to start pouring into your cup here. That's what I'm hearing. You need to start finding balance in your life for self-care because for a lot of you that's what the issue is here is that you're not taking time for yourself you're not taking any time for self-reflection you're not taking any time to kind of look in the mirror and um, think about yourself and think about who you are and think about who you want to be this is really important y'all Self-reflection is super important. You know, there there are times where, you know, when you're like really anxious, when you're really upset, that's not a time for self-reflection. That is a time to work on balancing your central nervous system. That is a time to start working on embodiment, like really start feeling your body and, you know, allowing the central nervous system to process those emotions in a way that it needs to. So, super important, super important work to do. And to recognize when, when is the time for self-reflection? When is the time to, um, for self-improvement even? When is the time to just open your heart to receive this manifestation work that you've been working on, you know? like. You really need to read the air, read the room, like read the vibes. <laughs> um, kind of get in tune with astrology, get in tune with the moon, you know? Um, get in tune with yourself. This is super important. If y'all are interested in this, I think you would be interested in my Empress Embodiment event. So go ahead and shoot me an email. The Hierophant. So y'all know. Y'all know this. You have this capability within you. You're letting the way that other people see you affect the way you live your life instead of doing what you want to do to make yourself happy. So just really start to look within and start to ask yourself, what do I want? What do you want? What do you want? <laughs> I'm going to pull one more card, I think. And then we're gonna get into the extended and we're gonna kind of clarify some things and get a lot more advice from spirit. So eight of blades, eight of blades. What we have here is releasing this cycle of, of hurt, hurting yourself, causing pain to yourself by potentially letting in divine masculine that doesn't serve you or, um, if you're like me, it's rattling your freaking mouth without thinking, rattling your head without thinking, and <laughs> stuff like that. So, stop being the source of your own misery and start thinking about what you can do to make yourself happy. That's all I got to say for this reading. If you were interested in the extended, we're going to kind of get into more advice from spirit we're definitely going to kind of clarify more on i think i want to find out like how this karma is um, manifesting in the in the in the 3d um we're gonna get into we're just gonna clarify so if you're interested in that
Instagram. Thank you so much for coming into my channel. Thanks for any likes, shares, subscribe, comments, and I can't wait to see you all again.